Hi, Dan Anderson with AMG Systems. And Luke with Campion. We're back. <laughs> Didn't take long. We, you know, we told you we were excited, right? Absolutely. Um, lots of uh, talk, obviously, in the first segment about mm -hmm. the partnership between Campion and AMG right. Systems. But now, I want to talk more on the product. Absolutely. Lots of development, lots of new stuff coming out on a continual basis. Uh, very, very, very sharp engineers that understand our market niche and mm -hmm. what we have to do. So, uh, with that, I want to talk about our flagship device. Okay, hit me. AMG 570 series. This is our managed switch series. Developed in-house. We own the IP uh, on the mechanical, the, the hardware, the, the software stack. This is our product. So okay. wait a minute, you're not just putting labels on it. You you actually got people with their hands touching We're it. We're not a label it. maker, no. Beautiful, no, no. beautiful. We, we, we developed the product, uh, made UK, lifetime warranty, TAA, NDAA compliant product. Uh, this particular model is built to live in uh, critical infrastructure, ruggedized environment, mission critical environment. So, uh, this particular guy has uh, three optical ports. Okay. These guys can have be at 100, 1,000, or 2.5 gig. What that means is we can have legacy-based optics connecting into this device. We can be backwards compatible to some of your existing infrastructure, but allow you to increase bandwidth significantly on the path back to the head end. Beautiful. Uh, the next piece is the access port. So we okay. have eight copper access ports. One of the big investments, and you're going to see this across the entire product line, is a big, big investment into 90 watt 802.3 BT. Oh, okay. So BT, as we're seeing more cameras with, with heater, blower, pan tilt zoom, multiple sensors, uh, these, large, these large format cameras that are out there, mm -hmm. they're requiring a lot of power. Absolutely. So... What I'm seeing, and I think what a lot of the, the folks out, out there are seeing, is a uh, situation where you have a, a mid-span that's powering that up, right? Normally. Mm -hmm. Not intelligent, provides power up to the device, away you go. That's great until the camera locks up. Then you bust out the ladder and go touch it. Could be five miles away, could be two hours away, could be, you, you don't know. So, so the right way to do it is to have it on an active port. Meaning, if we need to, 20 miles down the road, we can send a command to this individual port and do a power reset with that 90 watt up to the camera. That's huge. Yeah, saves time and money. I mean, that's the end uh, goal with, with, with everyone right 100%. now. 100%. So, so with our particular model, we have up to four 90 watt ports. Okay. We can do two 90 watt and four 30 watt or all 30 watt on this device. Uh, another couple of nice uh, options on this, we can take a standard 48 volt, 48 to, to 54 volt VDC input, mm -hmm. or we can take some legacy based 12 volt DC or 24 volt DC. Why is that important? A lot of solar applications have 24 volt DC in the cabinet. Yes. So, so the fact that you can do that all in one device is, is uh, unique and handy for the tech. But anyways, please go to our website www.amgsystems.com to get uh, more on the protocols, the functionality on this. Lifetime warranty, NDAA, TAA compliant device. Please come by and see us. Hey, Dan, thanks for walking us through this All great right. product and looking forward to more. All right.